my grandfather used to write these big long letters and just get it all out of his head. And interestingly, I saw my friend Peter Shaw wrote something similar in an email recently. It's good to write long letters and get it all out. And then he'd put in the top drawer. And if he still felt the same way the next day, he'd send it. Um, this is when they did letters, right? And you could apply the same principles to emails or big decision making. I won't make huge decisions like buying investments or assets or killing a program or tuning up a staff member or whatever. I will not make those big decisions if I'm tired or in a bad resourceful state. I've got to be well rested and I have to have thought it through. So I create a lot of white space in my program. My, my week has so much white space. In fact, yesterday I did nothing. I literally did nothing yesterday the whole day. And that white space, I was just actually reflecting. One of the big reflections I had, thank goodness I've got this time to just put things away for a while, leave them, and I see what finds me and I see what thoughts come. But the biggest thought I had is, well, thank goodness for the white space. And then when I did log in at the very end of the day to check my community, which I do every day, one of my members said, you know, one of the things you keep talking about, and he found this great quote about space, you know, you got to be able to think things through, but you can't think them through unless you create the space to have that time to think. And that's critical. Mm -hmm.